Hello and welcome to Cat's Face. My name is Vivek and today in this video I will be giving you a short demo on Sigma Nest software. Sigma Nest is one of the advanced cat cam nesting software in the industry. With this software you can import parts and assembly from any major cat system like SolidWorks. You can automate them into tasks by material and machine types. There are many machines supported like laser, plasma, oxyfuel, water jet and so on. Let us quickly have a look at this um, assembly, like a storage box you can find at your workspace. These are made out of sheet metal parts. You can have a look at the flat pattern view of the model. Uh, let's quickly jump to Sigma Nest and see how to import this file. Under workspace command tab, if you drop down this import file menu option, you have various um, import profile types that you can select to import. Uh, for this demonstration, let's have a look at the import SOLIDWORKS feature. You can either select the individual part to import or you can select the entire assembly and click on import. After that, you will get this open dialog box um, where you can apply different filters. For now, we'll leave it for default and hit apply filters. This is going to list all the parts associated with the assembly file. You can have a look at these part files under part list and the respective quantities. If you are building or uh, cutting them into more batch quantity, you can increase them from here. Let's say for example three of them, it will automatically increase the respective quantity size as well. And we'll click on OK. After that import process, you will get this new uh, part parameter dialog box. Uh, in this you have a small preview section for flat pattern view of individual parts. Under part data menu you can apply part name or work order. Uh, it looks like the material hasn't been specified so we'll quickly drop down and select the material from its database. And under this machine option you can select the different machine types. For this demo we'll leave on laser. The next step is to click on OK. Once all these parts are listed on your graphics window, the next step is to click on new task. And after that, under part list, um, you will have to click select all. And then we'll go to seat list. And we can either select the stock seat from the database or you can define a new task seat. So we'll make sure it's the same material and select the seat size. And make sure the quantity is enough to fit all the part quantities and hit add and done and we'll click OK. In this uh, nesting window you can either double click and drag and drop the um, part flat pattern manually or you can use the auto nest feature. This feature is going to place all of these parts in the, into the individual seat. Looks like only three seats are required. And the next step is to go to nesting NC and click on auto NC. In this window, you will have different settings to apply like cutting order, seat selection, the methods and direction. We'll leave it for default for now and click OK. It will generate the cutting path for each sheet, the parts that are inside the seat. To have a preview, you can click on play button here for the simulation of the tool path. You can select the part and click play button to see the cutting tool path. To post program to your profile cutting machine, you will have to click on NC post, click post all sheets and then click post all. With this status success, you can find the post file under the following path and click done. Uh, further to that you can also add more details like creating report of your job by clicking on report and clicking print. You can select the report type such as layout report, layout detail, also layout cost. We'll see these three for now and click preview. You can ha have a look on um, the job total weight, total coding time, the scraps, uh, true scraps and rectangular scraps, number of pierces, um, 
as well as you can also have a look at the layout detail of your job. In addition to that, you can also view the total costing based on the unit cost that you have added in your database. That's all for this demo. Um, please keep tuning into Cat Space for more video posts like this. Thank you.